Bristol City's players have been helping out aspiring journalists at a local secondary school. John Stead joined youngsters Tom King and Curtis Jones from the club's development squad at Gordana's school to take part in a mock press conference for BBC's school project. Answering questions from pupils, it was a different sort of grilling for the City Stars from the kind they're used to with the regular hacks and broadcasters. They came with some good questions, um, a few that um, sort of stumped me a little bit, but yeah, they, it's nice to see um, the kids getting involved and sort of taking an interest. Um, and, uh, you know, I see a lot of a lot of kids there budding for your job. Um, a lot of them probably a little bit better than you. So, um, and they're only, I think, 12 or 13. So, uh, yeah, there's a, a lot more progress to come from them, but yeah, they're good kids. And we now know that you like puzzles all of a sudden. Yeah, it's um, something I didn't really want to share with everybody. Um, Front page as, of the paper tomorrow now. As you can imagine, with uh, I'll, uh, I'll tweet a picture of it actually if I get it done tonight, but it's, it's, it's proving difficult. Um, it was actually a, a present from my mother-in-law. Um, so I've started it while my wife's been up in Huddersfield and, and Isabel have just been there. Uh, doing it while I've been on my ice machine. Um, so yeah, the jigsaw is coming on. It's a thousand piece uh, with the train express to Bristol on the front. So uh, fingers crossed I'll get that finished up tonight. I'll have to see how it goes. It's, um, football's not as big in Australia and over here they're a lot more interested and in Australia there's Australian rules and a lot of the younger kids love that. So it's quite refreshing to get kids that are really interested in what you're doing and how you're doing. The school is delighted with its link to Bristol City Football Club and they could soon be producing the next John Motson or Martin Tyler. There's definitely a few of them that are way more comfortable in front of the camera than others, uh, but luckily there's a lot of opportunity for those involved in script writing, uh, those that prefer to be behind the camera or in the editing room putting it all together, so luckily they get to all experience it, so if any of them do want to get involved with the presentation, uh, they can hopefully realise the, the kind of quick on the draw stuff that they have to come up with when asking questions and how to ask sensible questions. For the players, they feel getting involved in community projects of this nature is crucial for the club. Yeah, massive. I mean, I've, I live in Portishead. I have the whole time I've been in uh, been in Bristol, so um, I've seen a lot of the development that's been going on at, at the at the school here, and it's nice to get involved. Obviously, I do my stuff with the with the uh, community trust, and and it's, it's just good to see us out and about, and it gives the kids um, something to look up to. No, it's um, I really enjoyed it. It's a good chance to sort of give back to the community. I've only been here a short time in Bristol, but I, I like how the club's really. Um, big on giving back because I haven't been at another club that really does that to the extent Bristol do it and it's really nice to sort of help kids out and, and make their day.